cats eat first over here. Which bowl do you want, mate? Either one, either one. Starting around this time last year is when that whole journey began. deserve a donut I mean these are this is like the most highly rated donut place in Salt Lake City look at these things look at that shine you just know they did the glaze right with all that threw in two little munchkins for us look at Wally just yeah Wally's hard. killing it right now well cheers about to drive to Moab but we got the donut pack Mm. Oh. He's the donut freak here. I like him. He loves him. Mm. He's it really good. Yeah. Though. It's like a, a fresh Krispy Kreme. Yeah. Almost. Like but a, crispy, a little better. Yeah. Yeah, Krispy Kreme did donut holes. Mm, 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 mm. Damn. Yeah, that's real good. Yeah, I'm the donut freak, but look at that reaction right there. Alright. Four hour drive. We'll see you in, uh, I don't know, maybe at lunch. Who knows? Already tired. We just pulled up to a little stop just to pull off. We're like an hour into the drive, but we have like, we've had no lunch in our system. My brain, I can barely think right now, I feel like. But um, we're gonna make Sammy's. Really trippy getting used to a new camera, because I don't know if I should be, like I know I probably should be looking up, but the viewfinder is just so enticing. Oh, are these from their? Yeah. Damn. They're so red. This is from our friend's farm. Or not farm. Garden, but <laughs> yeah. look at that thing. That's a red tomato. That tomatoes. is the most red I've seen a tomato on the inside. You're gonna get some, don't you worry? My, my. The cats eat first over here. I promise I'll get more lively later on in the, the vlog. Yeah, we need more energy, Celeste. What the heck? No, I'm so tired. It's like we know we're just gonna be driving for a while. Yeah. Eating a ramen. Oh. 
just hit up a rest stop, use the bathroom, you know how it goes. We were just thinking how, like around this time last year, we were in the midst of looking for a van, buying the van. Deciding we wanted to do videos and then also like gathering the tools to convert the van, just researching a bunch of stuff. Researching a hell of a lot. Yeah. <laughs> we'll watch so many YouTube videos. Yeah. So it was like months of looking for vans and finally getting a van in early September last year. So around this time was when we had like pretty much just started, you know, taking out the shelves that were in there because it was like a delivery van sort of thing. I got to take off these seemingly rusted in nuts and bolts to take off this entire shelf. This is some major progress. Major progress. Like gutting it. A lot of sanding that thing down. Yeah, I honestly think like the beginning steps now, if we were to redo it, I think would go so fast. But since yeah. we like had zero experience with anything, like we've never built anything in our lives. Well, I, well I've never built anything. Yeah, I mean, I've built Legos, <laughs> 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 you know. Yeah, so like, just like those first couple of steps, like really getting the van super clean and primed and ready, that process took so long. And I just remember those beginning stages, like not even not even being able to like comprehend that we would actually be able to live in it. Like it just felt like such a long process, even from the very beginning. And yeah, like yeah. if you watch any of the build videos when we did, I think it was like the Max Air Fan or something, something ridiculous like that. I was like, oh, it'll probably take an hour. That was so funny. It took like all day. I feel like that was the beginning of us saying, oh, this should be easy, and then it never. Yeah. Because we own, like, at the time, I think we had, like, one screwdriver, and it was, like, a nub of a screwdriver. Yes. I think we have the clip. Not the best tool to use. Probably going to take forever. I don't know if I can even do the other side. So we had to buy a drill, impact driver, jigsaw, and a circular saw and that's, eventually. Yeah, that's all we used. I know some people... I'll probably talk about this eventually when we do the van tour, but like, I know some people have like some pretty intense tools. We just had like those, we mainly just used a circular saw and the jigsaw. Four tools. Yeah. It's doable. That's just crazy. That was our life for like seven months, but starting around this time last year is when that whole journey began and us just deciding like, oh yeah, let's document this on top of yeah. learning how to build everything for the first time. Learning how to do a lot of things at once. Yeah. And now we have this new camera. It's only took us like a year to really, really get yeah. something super compatible for vlogging. Wow. Seems like it took a long time. Whoa, that's, Whoa, a, that's huge a huge crow. crow. Yeah. God. Yeah. It seems like it was a long time but it's been only a year and we did so much yeah look at him on the rock bro that thing is big let yeah. me see if i can get this for you guys wow that just does not do it justice no it doesn't i wish i could go stand by it it's got to be over a foot tall crazy times crazy times yeah just thought we should bring that up Back to our journey? Yeah, back to it. Gotta do a park in the desert. My lips are so dry. Now where's the chopstick? I don't know. Ooh, yeah. Just stopped for the day. We drove about like four hours to, is it called Moab? Moab, Mo Moab, 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 um, in this like deserty area, pretty secluded. Got some other vans parked up next to us, which is nice. And we're going to make a, a quick little salad for dinner tonight. We had it last night and it was super good. Kind of just switching up flavors. Cause I feel like we do a lot of Asian and Spanish dishes like beans and rice and that whole ordeal or just like a stir fry and I know summer is ending but I randomly now starting to really crave some fresh salads Milo <laughs> what are you doing it's not it's not tuna this time it's not tuna I'll show you everything that goes in it and I thought I was just gonna end the video on this like travel day but we might bring you along to this is it a national park? Yeah, Arches. Arches Natural Na <laughs> Arches National Park tomorrow. So this might not be the end. We got sweet potato, carrots, cucumber, broccoli. This lemon will squeeze on top. Oh, and then I also should grab some salt. 
salt and pepper. This balsamic we put over the top. And then also some pumpkin seeds for some crunch on top. Red wine vinaigrette. This and a lemon for the topping. Guys, I'm loving this camera. potato and carrots are cooking down we'll make our base arugula and then baby and spring mix baby kale and spring mix uh, little basil that's some chicken that we have from yesterday Which bowl do you want, mate? Either one, either one. Going to enjoy this and I'll, we'll see you in a little bit. Top of the morning. Like I said yesterday, I wanted to take you guys to Arches National Park. We're on the probably the most popular hike, yeah. which is the Delicate Arch. Yeah. Only three miles. Probably gonna be crowded at the spot, but it's nice to get a little bit of movement in. Bloody hot. I was gonna wear a hat, but I was like, you know what? I don't want to get hot. I feel like an egg on a cast iron right now. Whoo! Andrew's just playing with a stick while I recuperate. Face is brutally red. Oh, 
the reality of coming to a popular spot. <laughs> <laughs> I am hot. Very hot. We are at one last little lookout. Andrew is keeping track of the hurricane that's happening in Florida and our hometown. Checking on friends and family. Yeah, making sure everybody's okay. Hurricane and Helene hit like I think like two weeks ago and now there's another hurricane coming ahead. It's just sad. It's just sad seeing that. And your hometown possibly maybe getting wrecked, but let's hope not. Yeah, just one more lookout for us and I think I'm gonna call it the video too. This place is pretty insane. Not pretty insane. This place is very epic. It looks like gods used to live here or something. Some of these mountains look like cities. Who knows? Maybe there was cities well, back I think in the no day. One's able to be here at night. Hmm. Oh, all right, so one last little lookout. Actually, there's a bunch of people are walking up to right now. Maybe we'll wait for the air conditioning for a little oh, bit longer. Oh, thing just pulled up. Oh, um, yeah, we're gonna wait a second. Maybe look at our next camping spot. Yeah, that's a good idea. Like this? Hey, yo. Arigato. <laughs>